Hello all. In this video, I am going to demonstrate how to create your own reference style in Zotero Reference Manager. In previous video of mine, I have described about how to do the same in Menly. In this video, I am going to show how to create your own reference and incorporate that into the Zotero. Here in this document, I am using Zotero. So if I click on Zotero, the Zotero documents will appear like this. To change the references, I need to go into this document preference. When I click on this document preference, this will appear like this. Since I have used Vancouver style for referencing by default it is showing this Vancouver styling these are all the very most commonly used reference styles so if you want to select from some of these styles you can select if you want some more styles there are some 9000 reference styles created in CSL editor you can go there click on this manage styles then automatically if you click this get additional styles Zotero will have about 9000 reference styles suppose let's say you want some variant in Vancouver if you type Vancouver here, there are so many Vancouver type of references available here. Likewise, there are 9000 reference styles available in this Zotero repository. You want something else. You want to make your own reference style tailor made for your own gate or for your own university or for the journal which you are going to publish. Then you have to go for this CSL editor that is you need to go to this editor.citationstyles.org. For that you need to go to Google type CSL editor. Automatically it will ask for visual CSL editor. CSL is nothing but citation style language for mainly Zotero also it will come. The reference software such as Mendeley, Zotero, Papers, Paper Pile all use this citation style language. So if we click on this CSL editor, then automatically this will be the page. So here the purpose of this website is to create your own citation style languages. You can find a style which is available. There are nearly 9000 styles, standard styles recommended by journals, universities are available here. If your journal or your university or your guide as for a different format of referencing both in terms of inline citation and bibliography you want some changes if you touch and change the inline citation and bibliography you cannot use that document later with the reference manager software in that case you need to create your own reference style so that is what we are going to see in this video so for that what i would suggest is we can go to this search by name i would suggest instead of creating a new reference style you try edit the already existing standard styles which is closer to your expectation suppose you want some modification in APA style click on this and edit to suppose let's say I want a modification in this I triple E format you click on edit here then automatically this edit page will appear there what we can do is you just confirm whether your inline citations want to be in numbers and brackets you want to change this just click on this and change this so you want to add any prefix and suffix also you can add you want this in to be in superscript I am just for demonstration purpose I am clicking on this in superscript so your inline citations will be in superscripts so that we have clicked and you want some changes here you want authors to be underlined if you click on the article you don't want this quotations you can click on this and remove this quotation we have underlined the author we have removed the quote here like that you can edit whatever you want then you can do so many other changes also like addition of uh, variables those things you can do there are multiple changes available you can make your own reference style according to your needs even a single full stop to any change if whatever you desire can be attained through this CSL editor. So I have for demonstration purpose underlined the authors, removed the quote from the title. So let me show how this change works. So before that I need to download this style. Before saving it, I am going to change the name of the style. So for this demo creating this style. So I triple E demo I have created. So then I go here style save style now i will click on ok so automatically this this page will appear so here we need to click on this download style automatically i triple e demo csl has been downloaded for zotero we need to go to preferences the steps has been put up here so now i go back to the document i go to document preference i click on this i triple e in order to show how i triple e without modification works so i click on this i triple e this is the default i triple e but now if we are going to incorporate our i triple e we need to go to this document preference we need to click on this manage styles in manage styles we need to click on this plus symbol then this i triple e demo which has been downloaded will be opened here 
once it is opened this will be available so now we need to go back to the document preference again so ieee demo will appear here so if we click on this ieee demo okay now as we said the brackets and the numbers has been converted into superscripts that was the inline citation change we made there then we asked to underline the author style then we have removed the quotation present for the title of the article all these changes has been incorporated as per our need same way we can change even a full stop to any changes which you desire in csl editor so through csl editor you can create your own reference style you can utilize this zotero reference manager effectively i repeat the steps for csl editor in zotero how to create your own reference style in zotero reference manager csl editor appears like this so in csl editor i would suggest to go with a standard reference style popular style closer to our modification needed click on the edit here you can change how your inline citations need to appear and you can change how your bibliography needs to appear it will ask for the changes needed so if you change here automatically those changes will uh, reflect in this here or you can give it as a command and this changes will appear here then after doing this uh, you have to change the name for your need then go to style save the style download style will appear here if we click on the download style the new download style will get downloaded here you can double click this csl file and automatically it will get installed in zotero it will ask like this you can do that way or you can click on this plus symbol you can install that here click on open then automatically this will appear here then again you need to go back to the document preferences the reference style will appear so in ieee demonstration click on that then click okay automatically as per the needs your document will get changed since we have not made it into superscript now it has appeared as a normal script same way the underline has gone quotation has reappeared because in this summary we have not changed anything in ieee style same way you can change change anything you want in and create your own reference style as per your guide or your journal or your university's needs hope this video was useful to you if you like this video please share it to your friends thanks for watching this video if you haven't subscribed to the channel please subscribe